Let's hit the road. Let's hit the road. That's me, Glenn Martin. Father, dentist, lover. But mostly father and dentist. I took my family on a road trip so we can grow closer. Well, that and I burned the house down. So it's me, my wife Jackie, she's the sweetest. Oh. Our son Connor, the ladies' man. His sister Courtney, we'll all be working for her one day. In fact, her assistant Wendy already is. Ooh, can't forget K9, he's got a giant heart. Wanna hear us whistle? Let's hit the road. Now that's what I call a Jackie O'Lantern. Oh! Glenn, can you please slow down? Going as fast as I can, honey. Ugh. This kitty knife is an insult, Mom. I'm an American 11-year-old. By now, I should have a knife and a gun. Oh, honey, you say the darndest right-wing things. Kids, I'm gonna have a nice, quiet chat with your father. You might want to turn up the music. Hey, Wendy, this is what our baby will look like. <laughs> I didn't know whose nose he's gonna have, so I gave him both. Connor, it could never work for us. You're 13. I'm 13 and a half. You're a child. I'm the assistant to a very powerful female executive. Oh, smack! Shut down! Game over! Wanna play again? Please insert 50 cents. Wow! In front of the baby. Not cool. Glenn, pull over. We need to talk. No can do. We gotta be at the wheel nonstop if we're gonna make the Phoenix Falafel Fest on November 1st. And I'd feel awful... Don't say it. ...if we missed the falafel. <laughs> Every time. So, you're really going to keep us on the road until after October 31st? Yeah, that's the plan. Every year, you ruin Halloween. Trick or treat! I'm Rachel from TV's Friends. Could you be any scarier? A toothbrush? Now just take oh, one. Wow. <laughs> Trick or treat! Hi, I'm Cindy Bristow from the TV show Alias. Dental floss? Now just take one. I'm Amy Winehouse. I got a big voice and big problems. And I'm <laughs> Jackie, I'm a dentist, okay? I've seen the horrors that sugar can inflict. Tooth decay, gum disease, root rot on a five-year-old boy. He was just a boy. Thanks, Hawkeye. We get the melodrama. Seven teeth went down that day. There were no survivors. It's enough that we live on the road. Just once, can't we have a normal Halloween? Let's find a nice neighborhood and, and do this holiday right. Complete with- Oh, not the C word. Yes, candy. Harmless, delicious candy. Oh, it's like I'm married to a sailor. No, I'm sorry, Jackie, I'm not comfortable doing that. Okay, I understand. You know what I'm not comfortable with? You're burning down our house. All our memories up in flames. Our wedding photos, poof. All right, all right. Jeez, you accidentally torch one house down and you never hear the end of it. Are you sure you want to celebrate Halloween here? I mean, it's a little scary. It's supposed to be. It's Halloween. I'll kill you. Why? That's the spirit. plans for Halloween, because we're gonna party Martin style. Oh no, passing out toothbrushes again. Thank you, Connor. You are all invited to our home for Halloween tomorrow. We are going to blow the doors off this place. Too late, tornado already done that last week. All right, mom, we're off to see the sights. Okay, no problem. Hold hands when you cross the street. I know. And remember our phone number song in case you get lost. Four, six, two, three, six, one. Mom! I see you're mad. You can go. Ugh, that woman treats me like a child. Yes, I'm 11, but I have the stress of a 40-year-old. Uh-oh. Uh, What's wrong? I thought we were gonna play tetherball. There's some kids there already. They look older. And cooler. We should run away. Oh! Oh! I told you they were cooler. Run! Oh! Connor's right. Let's get out of here. Please. We can totally hang with the older kids. Hey, what you guys doing? Playing truth or dare. But you might be more at home in the sandbox. Delvin, truth or dare? Truth. Did you kill my dog? I mean dare. Come on, Glenn. Oh, 
fine. Can I just second? Welcome, strangers. Hello, Erasmus. What a charming little store. Now, nah, don't go stealing from me just because I got a milky eye. I didn't notice. What? That's why we came in here. You wanted to get a better look. Anyway, we are the Martins, and you are cordially invited to our Halloween extravaganza. No, Erasmus don't go out on Halloween. Not with the werewolf on the loose. I, I'm sorry, what did you just say? Erasmus. After that, it, it sounded like werewolf. Yep. They say he roams these parts, seeking revenge for being a werewolf. Yeah, not much of a backstory there. No, no, it's the perfect amount of backstory. It, it lets your imagination run wild. You know what else runs wild? The werewolf. Oh, <laughs> wonderful! <laughs> I warned you, you should have picked truth. All right, little Miss Biz. I dare you to spend seven minutes in heaven with the monkey boy. Oh. That monkey boy is my brother? Didn't stop us. <laughs> I knew you were a baby. <laughs> <laughs> um, wait. She'll do it. She's my assistant. Go kiss Connor. Hmm. Um, I've been meaning to talk to you about boundaries. Please. <sighs> Fine. Oh, whatever. As long as someone's kissing the monkey boy. <laughs> right. And where exactly is heaven? Inside the love shack. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, though I walk through the valley of the shadow of rock. Lollipop. I. Bubble gum. No, no, no. Candy bars. <laughs> sure, you get a sweet buzz at first, but then tooth decay, gum disease, gingivitis. <laughs> Say the Say the words! I Glenn Martin, future DDS will never eat sugar again. <laughs> Class dismissed. Oh. <sighs> Thank you. This is going to be the best Halloween ever. Yeah, great. Now you two be careful. Mind the werewolf. <gasps> oh, that's just my ringtone. Rasmus, I sure I'd like the New York Times on Sundays. Oh, it smells. Wasn't me. I know that. Let's just get this over with. <sighs> Oh, I am the man! Oh, yes! C to the N to the O to the R! Ugh, you don't even know how to spell your own name! Oh, yes. Wow, he is the man. <laughs> Jackie, you know, it's bad enough you're pushing this junk on innocent kids, but eating it right in front of me? It's a harmless piece of candy, Glenn. Don't you sometimes feel like a nut? Actually, sometimes I don't. Hey, I'm not afraid to party, but I don't need chocolate to have a good time, okay? Forgive me if I heed the warnings of the American dental. Mm. Mm. Well, this stuff is better than I remember. Yeah, the secret is high fructose corn syrup and trans fat. The Democrats are trying to take that away from us. Hey, this stuff gets the heart pumping. Speaking of which, how about we... Just have some more chocolate. <laughs> there we go. Mm -hmm. Nice job, neighbor. Why, thank you. I just hope I'm not upstaging anyone because... <laughs> Listen, I just want to thank you for kissing Connor. I know that must have been tough. Yeah, tough. <laughs> yeah! Huh! Oh, oh. oh, he's tough. How dare that hussy try to show me up like that? Kids, I need spiders, skulls, bones. I'm not telling anyone to go to a cemetery and dig anything up, but I'm not telling anyone not to either. Ooh, hello, sugar. Hey, Snuggle Bear. Now, I know it's against your whatever, but I need you to run to the store and get more candy. No problem. 
Damn it, Glenn, you... Oh. Okay, item three, Halloween costumes. I'm thinking female duos. They should be glamorous, famous. Got it, Meg Whitman and Don Lepore. eBay's board of directors, bingo. Buy it now. PayPal purchase confirmed. I love Connor. What? I know, it's crazy, he's disgusting, he's foul, but I think I love him. Woman, have you lost your mind? I sniffed his t-shirt, it smells like B.O. and awesomeness. My afterbirth of a brother? Have you seen the log cabin he's building with his dirty Q-tips? Yes, and I want to live in it. Something happened in that porta potty something chemical. Yeah, the toilet cleaner fried your brain. I know, it's terrible, he's an animal. Do you think he likes me? Oh, God, you need to either help me or kill me. Shh, it's gonna be okay. And if it comes to that, I'll do it while you sleep. Oh, Connor, you taste like ranch corn nuts, and I love it. Mm. <laughs> Dr. Martin. Wendy? I'm back. Thanks. Wait, this felt lighter than usual. Damn recession. Paying more, getting less. Wait a minute. These bags are half empty. Really? Well, I see them as half full. Glenn, how much candy have you eaten? How much candy have you eaten? Open your mouth. You open your mouth. Your tongue is bright blue! Uh, oh. All right. I may have had a little bit of candy. Glenn, you are not ruining this holiday for me. I have put too much fake blood, sweat, and tears into this. Come on, it's Halloween. What, at Christmas you don't want me drinking eggnog? What's with all the fireworks, Glenn? It's 4th of July. Yeah, that's right. Erasmus, buddy, what's happening? What's new? What's going on? Hey, listen up, here's the thing. I need some candy. Can't sell you what I don't got. How you fix for the New York Times? That old gray lady's way too liberal for Erasmus. Oh, you gotta have something, right? Any marshmallow peeps left over from Easter? Hanukkah gelt? I'll take anything. What do you got? Come on, come on, come on. Sorry, I'm closing shop. It's four o'clock. Halloween night. I'm keeping werewolf hours. Listen, you old coot, I know you got something. I'll pay $10,000 for a $100,000 bar. That's a profit of $90,000. Sorry, all out. Hey, talk about timing. The sugar truck man just drove up. Where? Where? Hey, monster thing, Dora the Explorer. Candy inspector, gotta inspect the candy. Make sure it's on the up and up. Mm. M&M, nothing bad there. Okay. What jerk gave you the toothbrush? Mama! Get away, freak! <laughs> Thank you. Oh, hey. Wow, I just stole candy from a baby. And it was easy. Welcome to the scariest house in the park. Eh. What, you're not creeped out? Nothing's gonna top next door. They killed a real pig in front of us. I'm gonna have nightmares for a week. Oh, it is on. Canine, guard the door. Oh, wow. Oh, why does your brother have to be such a dreamboat? Wendy, it's a textbook adolescent crush. I know about these things. Huh? I read about it on Wikipedia. Oh my god, Trisha is totally flirting with Connor. What am I gonna do? Just relax. Breathe. You don't understand! I am Calm down. This is going to pass. Oh, thank you. I don't know what I'd do without you. Connor! Be my boyfriend! What? Back off, trailer trash! What? He's mine! Really? You like me? I know, it's crazy, but I do. I need you like a Vista user needs a Hindu tech support guy. All right, enough. 
someone's had a little bit of a breakdown. Let's get you home. You can make me some tea. All the cool kids are making out by the dumpster. I thought you'd never ask. Wait, you can't leave me, Wendy. We're a team. No one's gonna know I'm Meg Women without Don Labore. Sorry, Courtney, but you'll understand when you're older. I'm totally old enough to understand all that stuff and junk. Sugar. Where people in love go. Are you okay, Connor? Lungs collapsing. Well, look who's joining the varsity tonight. Y'all need some protection? Um, you know, on account of the werewolf. Now you two go make out. Mm. Oh, yeah. There's my chow. <laughs> werewolf. I'm gonna get you once and for all! Ah, Erasmus too young to go to hell! Hey, Court, check it out. The Superstore was out of Halloween stuff, so I'm gonna turn this Santa Claus into Satan Claus. Oh. Is everything okay? I've never seen you in something so age-appropriate. Let's say, hypothetically, that you had an employee. And then that employee left you for your rival company. Your gross, smelly rival company, whose chief product is Bacne. Is this rival company, by chance, owned by the same parent company? Maybe. Sweetie, rivalry among companies is natural. It's even harder when one of those companies is the slightest bit more established than your company. Maybe I should just dissolve the corporation. No, your employee will come back. Trust me. Mommy, do you think the shareholders would think less of me if I cried? No, honey, not at all. <laughs> hey, is that my retainer? Yeah, I wear it to think of you. Oh, dear penthouse forum. Oh, Connor, what we have will last forever. Hmm. <sighs> <sighs> Okay, I'm out. Oh. Ladies and gentlemen of the trailer park, hang on to your wallet chains. Behold! Glenn? <laughs> it's the werewolf! Get him! Yeah! yeah. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> oh, damn it! and compassionate. I don't know what twisted path he followed to be covered in cotton candy and what I hope is chocolate, but he is a loving father, husband, and traveling dentist. I turned him into this by making him do something that went against every fiber of his being. And now I can see how wrong I was. <laughs> if anyone here is a monster, it's me. She's a monster! Get her! <laughs> Hi, I'd like to reapply for the job of assistant to a very powerful female executive. What are your qualifications? I want to work for the greatest boss in the world. Wendy Park, you are officially rehired. Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. I never stopped loving you. What? Nothing. Oh, Wendy. It's over, Connor. Oh, how about now? How about never? Uh. Hi, honey. Are you okay? 
My sweet Jacqueline, what happened to me? Oh, Glenn, where should I begin? I know. First, you burned our house down. Then, what few things were left, you made us. Oh, look! It's the sugar truck man. 